Today, at a launch event in China, Vivo has announced its much-anticipated smartphone, Vivo Nex. The Vivo Nex is a production version of the Vivo Apex smartphone, that was showcased by the China-based company during the Mobile World Congress. The smartphone comes with a 6.59-inch Super AMOLED Ultra Full View display, with a screen-to-body ratio of 91.24% and 2316 into 1080 pixels screen resolution. The phone comes with a screen soundcasting technology, which basically means that speakers are integrated with the screen. Further, all the sensors on the device are hidden under the display. Because of the narrow bezel surrounding the display, Vivo had to come up with a unique solution for the front-facing camera. And thus, one of the highlights of the phone is that, it comes with a pop-up front-facing camera. The 8-megapixel front-facing snapper, when started, will make a sound to notify the user. The device features a third-generation in-display fingerprint scanning technology, which according to the company increases the screen unlock time by 10% and increases the overall experience of phone unlocking. On the back side, there are dual camera setup, which consists of 12 megapixel sensors, primary being a Sony IMX363 sensor with 1.4 micron pixels, f/1.8 aperture, and 4 axis optical image stabilization, and a 5 megapixel secondary sensor. The phone also has Vivo Game Engine, which is made in partnership with Tencent Games. It aims to provide an immersive gaming experience, based on software and hardware optimization, and is also optimized to run games made using Unreal Engine. Further, the Vivo NEX also features 7.1 channel 3D audio, thanks to DTSX partnership. It also has Vivo Hi-Fi V1 system in package technology, for hi-fi quality sound through earphones. The Vivo NEX smartphone comes in three variants. The high-end model, dubbed as Vivo NEXS, is powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 845 processor along with Adreno 630 GPU, 8GB RAM, and 256GB internal storage. The mid-end variant has the same specs as that of the highest-end variant except for the internal storage as it packs 128GB storage. Further, the smartphones come equipped with the company-owned personal voice assistant Jovi, which works on artificial intelligence technology. It supports several functionalities such as smart map reading, encyclopedia, shopping, translation, scanning, and screen recognition among others. It will keep learning based on the understanding of the user. In future, the company will be rolling out several new features, related to this Jovi voice assistant. There is a dedicated button on the side of the camera that triggers Jovi, on the long press action. Vivo says that it has established AI joint laboratories with partners, with an aim to provide a brand new user experience through AI intelligence. The smartphone comes with Vivo newly designed custom user interface, Energy UI, running on top of Android Oreo operating system out of the box. Further, the device also supports engine-level SDK optimization, HPUE technology antenna layout, and a zero-sensor cooling system. The Vivo NEX will be available in two color options Diamond Black and Ruby Red. The high-end model with 8GB RAM is priced at 4,998 yuan, which roughly converts to $780 while the mid-range device costs 4,498 yuan approximately $702. On the other hand, the cheapest variant with SD710 costs 3,898 yuan which roughly converts to $609.